you're taking a lot of risk in building this business. Do you realize that? Now, that might scare you and that might deter you from ever taking the first action steps in order to get the momentum going. But if you don't learn to stick with it, then how can you materialize your success and better your overall lifestyle? Unfortunately, this was the fate that was shared with one of my former friends way back when I was still friends with them in the years of 2018 and going into 2020. So I once knew this guy. Now, we'll just call him Felipe. And Felipe was a guy that I was friends with since I was a junior in high school. And him and I, we've had some history together, just to simply put it. But he did have some trust in me to share what his dreams were. His dreams were to go out and become a great voice actor and even a script writer too. He had a huge passion for the acting industry, the movie industry, and he wanted to go out and make it big. So he actually made his own play in which he wrote the script and he originated the characters and he even got one of his college well the college that he was going to he got them to approve it and they were able to actually let his play go live in the performing arts theater at the college he was attending and it was a big success everybody loved it and everyone that got selected for the roles in that play loved playing their parts. It was a huge success, and it was a home run for my friend Felipe. The problem was he didn't really hone in on his craft. And what do I mean by that? He didn't really go out and learn from the best of the best in the industry that he was expressing interest in. In fact, even if he did, he had a lack of confidence. He didn't really entirely believe in his ability to actually go forth and become a great voice actor and a script writer, even with the success of the play that he wrote, that he wrote the story for and wrote the script for, even after that success, he didn't believe he could do it. So what he did was when things got tough and his mom did some really crazy shenanigans, he had to move out and move in with his friend. And I remember that time I was helping him move his stuff in order to move to his friend's place. And ever since that time, he was, he's been, he moved to his friend's place. He's just been content with only following the common roadmap, continuing to go to school, just living and existing and staying working at 99 cents. So he's been at the same job for a really long time. But the thing with him is he doesn't really feel like he can afford to take the risk because he already got duped by his mom. He's living with this friend right now and barely has any money to save up to move into his own place. And to top things off, he's just content staying in the box. He doesn't want to take the risk and therefore he stays doing the same things he was doing since 2018. Now, I feel sorry for him because it really took a toll on his confidence and his belief. And his friends didn't really help much either. They were all the types of people that didn't really go after what they wanted. They just wanted to get by and not have to deal with other people. So it's really important that you learn from Felipe's story because if you're sitting there right now 
just thinking to yourself like all the risk that you're going to having to be taking from building this affiliate marketing business well i got news for you how can you have that success if you're not willing to make some sacrifices along the way how can you have that success if you're not willing to take the risk you have to be willing to take the risk in order to get to the reward there's no other way around it you got to realize that doing something beyond what most people are willing to do it not only takes courage and strength but you got to make a commitment to it and even when it gets tough you got to learn how to manage your risk instead of avoiding them do you know that if you don't take the risk right now you're just squandering all your chances of being successful in your business of really making it work for you in fact you always take risk every day of your life every time you step out the door of your own home you're taking a risk every time you get into a car you're taking a risk but you do it anyways because you got to live you can't always just stay boxed in your own home so why can you not treat building a business the same way this industry is going to require you to live on the edge for a bit to have to face challenges along the way and they won't be easy but they're not impossible it all depends on how important is it to you now for my friend felipe voice acting is a passion of his script writing is a passion of his but unfortunately he lacked the belief that he could really do it because he didn't he wasn't focused on the right activities he didn't go to somebody that would really help him navigate the industry and so he's been learning all this stuff on his own whenever he has the time and he's just merely living and existing because he's just focused on his circumstances he's not willing to get uncomfortable in order to get to where he wants to go see the reason why you're not seeing any success right now in your business is because you're not willing to get uncomfortable in order to get to what's waiting for you on the other side you're so scared of oh if i take that chance i'm worried about what's going to happen if that happens or this happens but what about what's going to happen when you do take that risk what about what are the things that are going to be awesome how much better is your life going to be when you do take that risk you see you can't stay paralyzed into speculating about all the things that can go wrong the worst question and the most expensive question that you can ask yourself is what's going to happen if it doesn't work out you can't put a focus on that the more that you do the more likely you're going to hold yourself back you're going to be full of doubt and you're never going to take action you can't put a focus on that you got to put a focus on the vision of how much better the quality of your life is going to be when you achieve building a successful business when you're profitable when you have income coming in on a daily basis every month and it covers more than what your basic necessities are and more than helps you and your loved ones what's that lifestyle going to look like for you focus on thinking about that and putting a focus on it cuz you can't put a focus on what you don't want on speculating what's going to happen those risks and challenges are going to be coming your way no matter what you do you just got to pick and choose your struggle but 
realize that this darkest just before the dawn and the dawn is coming if there's anything that i learned from my own journey and even recently recently i had to go through a job loss unexpectedly and it took me some time to recover and to heal from that but what i realized along the those months that ever since that it happened was i couldn't be focused on the pain of what happened or speculating about oh what's gonna happen if no money's gonna be coming in and this is gonna be uh disastrous so keep it in mind don't be afraid to take the risk manage the risk don't avoid it and keep going <laughs>